Well, how are we doing out there? I hope you're all absolutely spot on. And thank you very much for watching this video. Now, I've been shopping. I've been to Iceland. Come and have a look what I've got. So this is new, a new range out. Um, <laughs> I, I'm struggling pronouncing this. I know it's a, a restaurant chain. Is it Chiquito? Did I get that right? Anyway, this is that. Um, pulled pork burrito bowl. Uh, tortilla filled with vegetable and basmati rice mixed marinated shredded pork topped with creamy cheese sauce, salsa cheese and jalapenos with a 2 chilli rating and a 460 gram serving suggestion. Look at that. This is that. And it was four pounds. Four quid. Now I did, I did the pulled beef one. So I'm going to see if this is similar. Um, I'm going to cook this a little bit different to the last one. I did the other one nine minutes in the microwave and finished it off in the air fryer for five minutes. I'm just going to do this one in the oven because I've got a few jobs to do. And I was told do it in the oven um, for best results. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try it in the oven. So let's have a look at the, let's have a look at the box. So there's a the nutritional information. If you want to pause that and have a look at that, by all means, go ahead. 778 calories in this meal. Um, so yeah, it's very calorific. Very, very high in, well, everything. <laughs> uh, they are the ingredients as well. If you want to pause that and have a look at them, by all means, go ahead. We've got a few allergens in there, haven't we? We've got wheat, milk, uh, milk, 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 barley, milk. Um, have a look at all them. Uh, pork, 14% it's got there. Anything else? 14%. Well, I thought it'd be more than that, but there we go. Um, so cooking instructions for best results, cook from frozen, which this is. Um, oven from frozen. I was told in the cooking instructions, whichever one goes first is the preferred method. So I'm going to do it in the oven anyway. So I'm preheating the oven now, fan 180, gas 6. Uh, remove out of packaging and pierce film lid several times. Place on a tray in the middle of the oven for 40 minutes into cooking time. Remove film lid and stir and give it a further 10 minutes. So it's 50, 50 minutes plus your 5 minutes, 55 minutes till you can get it down your grid. <laughs> wow. Well, I've got loads of jobs to do in the house, so I'll just leave it, leave it alone and crack on. And um, what else? Recycle a cart and I do that exclusive to Iceland. And it says a little bit about it there, doesn't it? Um, Chiquito, pulled pork, burrito bowl, plain tortilla flour filled with vegetable. Uh, well, I said that, I said that on the front. This is that. So let's get it open and have a look, see what we have got for our four quid, remember. So there we go. And a little um, little cord on there as well. You could scan that, I think, and um, probably tells you where it's been made or whatever. Um, I'm not quite sure. I'll have to have a look in the small print on that one. And some more information there. 13th of September, 22. So basically, you can put this in your fridge for like nine months. <laughs> or your freezer even, not your fridge. It's similar to the other one. I think it'll be exactly the same, apart from it'll be pulled pork and the other was um, pulled pulled beef. Um, so yeah, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get on with it now and I'll bring you back when it's done. So it's done, it smells absolutely, well oh, it smells delicious, <laughs> can't wait to get into this. Um, so if this is your kind of uh, video, um, please give it a thumbs up. And if you've not subscribed, well maybe consider subscribing because that does help. And leave a comment as well, let me know what, if, what you think of this range. I know it's a restaurant range, isn't it? I've never never heard of them. Uh, Chiquito, never heard of them. And, and from the, the last video I've done, well I did them habanero chicken wings and I expected better. Um, I th thought the sauce was a little just lackluster. It needed something to take it to another level for three and a half quid. But the, the pulled um, beef I did, that was lovely. Really was. So I'm hoping that this is going to be as good. So come and have a look at this. This is that. Let me see if I can get a bit of better light for you. There we go. Have a look at that. Oh, I mean, it, it's going to be nice with all that cheese and pulled pork. It's got to be in peppers, jalapenos. Look, and that's what you get, look. 
And that is it. So let's get it open. Let's get it in onto a plate. So I've come prepared this time. I struggle getting the other one out. Um, so I got lots of comments saying, right, so why don't you um, cut the side of this and see if you can get it out with a fish slice. So that's what I'm doing. Look. So I didn't need to cut it, but I'm trying to get it all out in its entirety. Look. It's stuck to the bottom. Unfortunately, it's stuck to the bottom. Look. Can you see? Well, it's coming, it's coming. Just takes a bit of the old uh, the persuasion. Because when I got the other one out, I just basically flopped it out. I just flopped it out onto the plate. And it was, um, it, it didn't look too, too good, did it? So I'm hoping that this looks a bit better. Cool, there we go. Look. That's looking a bit better, isn't it? Let's put that to one side so you can have a good look at that now. Gone a bit crispy on edges, look. And I've got a few comments as well saying a burrito it should be like folded over on itself, but I mean, you know, can't have everything, can you? And I'd be inclined to stick a load of black pepper over the top of that, but I'm not going to do that. So I'm going to try it first. I'm going to have a look, so... Oh, look at that. So there's your rice, so there's your pulled pork, look. Let's get a closer look at that. There's your pulled pork. And there's your rice underneath, look. Cool. Can't wait for this. I'm salivating. I really am. There it is. Oh, it's red hot as well. It's just out the oven. Oh, that's tasty. Let's have a look. Get a bit of that. There's quite a lot of rice, but let's get some of that cheese as well. Let's try it all together. Have a look at that. Cheesy goodness. Mmm. <laughs> Oh, that's nice, that. I like that. I'm getting a bit of heat there as well, but it's tasty. It really is. Let's have a look, see how much pork you get. Um, oh, you've got pork there, look. A bit more pork over here. Now, it's 13% pork, look. You get rice as well. I mean, it's four quid, mind, but... It's a tasty... It's, it packs a little... It packs a taste, a flavour. Let's all mix it up. That's how you do it, wouldn't you? And you sort of roll it in that. I'm going to try and roll it in that as well. <laughs> Not looking great there, like I must admit, all sp splodged together. But there we go. That is the nature of the dish. It all looks the same in your mouth, doesn't it? Let's be honest. <laughs> mm. Mm. Mm, that's tasty, that. Mm, taste. I, I, I'd, I'd, la I'd lather it with um, more, more peppers, um, and a bit, bit more pepper. Sorry, and probably some hot sauce. I put some more hot sauce over it and take it from um, a two chili rain probably to a six. <laughs> but that's just my pre preference, and that's what I'm going to do. But I won't do it on. I won't. I'll spare you all that. I'm going to take it in the front room and sit down with a cup of with a brew and I'm going to get into it. <laughs> I'm going to enjoy it. So let's, let's see if I can roll it up. I don't think I'll be able to, will I? To be honest. I certainly won't be able to roll it up and pick it up anyway, but that's what you get. Look, that's the bottom bit. Let's get into a bit of that. I didn't try that before, did I? Oh. Oh, I've got cold. Full of cold as well. I mean, I can taste it. Luckily, it's not COVID. <laughs> not that horrible, uh, horrible thing that's going round. It's a cold. 
Mm. It's nice, it's good, I think. Different taste, different flavours to the um, the pulled beef. I prefer the pulled beef, but that is nice though. Um, would I buy it again? Uh, I probably would as a treat. I'd probably buy the other one, the beef. I prefer the, the beef than that. Um, it's probably an 8 out of 10. So thanks very much for watching. If you got this far, doff me capped here. All the best and, uh, and take care and I'll catch you on the next one.